it's so hard. I can't even go anymore because it's off kilter. So this was actually my mother's house. Um, she bought it about 13 years ago. Um, she passed away and then we inherited the house. Two years ago, we started noticing um, just like dips in our yard, the kitchen, the windows not shutting properly, like getting stuck. My deck here, one of the beams underneath totally broke off um, and the deck was lopsided, like leaning totally to the um, left. We had to have somebody come in and put, you know, new beams in there and we're just spending a lot of money all of a sudden and on beams it seems. The wood was bent like this. I had to call a contractor. He came and he said, um, your kitchen is at high risk of falling through the ceiling and, and collapsing into the basement. He said he could put this in, which is a, another kind of jack. Um, he installed it and every two weeks he had to slowly crank it up to get the kitchen floor back level so that everything wouldn't crumble. So it's costing us a lot of money and so far we've spent about $4,000 on um, just upkeep with the house because of this. Once Mrs. P, uh, she's a neighbor of ours that came around and she had a sinkhole. Um, once she came to the, to the door and was asking, you know, kind of like, hey, have you had any trees falling lately? Or, you know, um, we got to talking and then I, I said, wow, you know, I have similar things happening in my yard. More often than not, when I leave the house with or without my husband, I have a tendency to drive up and down all the, the roads and the side streets and just kind of look at everything and see what's going on. And then I started noticing that the trees had changed positions. They, they weren't just merely moving with the wind. They were literally not in the same positions that they were in prior. Well, this is the house who told me they have the disappearing hole. I put grass seed there a couple years, and uh, it just keeps sinking in. Everything you put in there, topsoil, we dump stuff from the grill, stuff from the fire pit and it just keeps sinking. Sounds a lot different than the rest of the ground. I don't know if you can hear it. Asia's the one who has the crack in the backyard, all the way from the back to the, fr to the front, and she's got uh, water in her basement that's heaving up through the cement. Yeah. The scientific aspect of the geology is not resolving the immediate problem. And the immediate problem is the fear and that the people are undertaking each and every day in this area now that they're aware of the things that are happening. And these weren't things that I pointed out to them. These were things they pointed out to me. The, these are things that are not covered under your homeowner's insurance. Um, so it just seems like one thing's happening after the other. Um, so we just want to know when there's going to be an end to it.